Hi, this is Stephanie with Bright Guy, and I'm here today at Streamlight in Eagleville, Pennsylvania with Mike Deneen, who's very kind to sit and talk about Streamlight with us today. Um, so, Mike, how did, the, how did Streamlight start? When did you guys get started? Well, 40 years ago, Stephanie. First of all, welcome to Streamlight. Thank you. We're really <laughs> glad you could join us here at our, here at our facility. Uh, it, it started really over 40 years ago with uh, a contract with NASA to develop a five million candle power light. Wow. And then that brought you guys to the Streamlight One Million, right? Exactly. Which is your we, first light to go to market. We were able to develop the five million candle power light for NASA. We met that contract and then we developed the Streamlight One Million as our first commercial light. Mm -hmm. Well, great. We still have it today, even 40 years later. <laughs> we could probably get this up and running for you. If you yeah, want. no, that's okay. That won't be necessary. <laughs> And then you guys really moved into the police and, and duty lights, correct? We did. The Streamlight 1 million, originally, the first uh, little bit of success that we had with it was with law enforcement with search and rescue. Mm -hmm. And so that really led then to some of the other lights that you see here on the table. The uh, SL35 and the SL20 became a very popular light for us with law enforcement. Yeah, and then it moved all the way up to today with the SL20 LP, which is the latest model. Now it's up to 350 lumens, which is really great. And um, yeah, you guys are branching out with your HP, HL, and Tradition B models. Tell us about that. Well, you can tell we like generations of lights. So yeah. we take a lot of concepts that work over the years, and then we try and expand on those concepts that mm -hmm. work for our customers. So today we have uh, our Stinger line of lights, our Stryon line of lights, and really within those lines, we have three different kinds of output of light. Mm -hmm. So depending on the application you have in the field, you might want one of our traditional Stinger LEDs, which is a nice balance of lumens and candela and a very good value uh, if you're watching the purse strings. <laughs> uh, we also have the HP line of Stingers, which is for downrange light, very good for search and rescue. Yeah, high and performance, then, correct? Exactly, yeah. exactly. And then we just recently introduced the HL line of Stingers, which is high lumen maximum illumination mm -hmm. uh, type lights. You also d just redesigned your headlamps, the Trident, the Scepter, and the Argo, and those are more for your industrial market. So tell us about those. How do those work? Well, we do a, a lot of headlamp business in a couple different markets. Uh, industrially, certainly, in, uh, with our petrochem customers, our utility customers that need hands-free operation, our headlamps are very popular. And it's the same concept. Those three different headlamps have really three very different outputs. Uh, so the scepter is very good when you're doing work maybe at arm's length. Uh, the Argo is very good when you need to put light down range or maybe you need to shine light up on a fitting that maybe is 15 or 20 feet up in the air. And then the Trident line is really a nice blend of both of those, they give you some downrange light. It also gives you nice light to work by. So we're tr basically trying to keep up with technology, and that's why we're upgrading all these lights now. Yeah, and tell me a little bit about Streamlight as a company now. You know, how many people do you employ? You're you're branching out globally. We have really well over 200 employees, and we're all here at one location in Eagleville. Yeah. So everything from engineering and design to test facilities and then all of our production is here in Eagleville, and then all of our support functions like human resources, accounting, and then sales and marketing, all right here under one roof. Oh, great. Well, thanks for talking with us today, Mike. We appreciate it. Sure.